Fat Punch! Hello and welcome to that man. That is my merchandise and today we're looking at Fire Punch, the manga, released to us by Viz Media under their signatures line or their SIG line, whichever you want to call it. Uh, that's the line where they usually kind of have like more adult content rather than just plucky shown and stuff. Um, there's usually people dying and horrible things happen. Whereas in Shonen, it's still kind of just like, oh, well, something's happened, but we'll get through with the power of friendship. <laughs> um, and this tells the story of two orphans where they have this mysterious ability. Um, it's pretty hardcore, like the first few pages that they're basically having to eat off um, one of the, the, the limbs because they've got re this lad's got regenerative ability. And so yeah, they, they're just eating his, his flesh because they're, they're going to starve otherwise. And he's just regenerating over and over again. Um, stuff happens here and there, like these people find them and it's like, oh well, they end up mass killing the entire village and then he gets set on fire, except he won't die because of his regenerative abilities. And so he spends a long time in absolute agony just burning to death over and over and over again until he basically starts to control the flames and yes I the first thing that people see when they see that is like oh it's Todoroki I bet he's all edgy like him oh. <laughs> but yeah um it, that's what people got enticed by with this it's like oh it's this must be a spin-off of Todoroki no, it's not. It's uh, it's very, very graphic. And uh, basically, this lad, he's called Agni, which, yeah, fire. And um, he struggles to survive and he vows revenge on the people who tortured him because, unfortunately, they killed all of his family and uh, ends up killing his um, sister as well. So he ends up just going around punching and attacking people with these flames and it's like it sounds cool but it's really depressing you just go around and murders all these people and it's um it's absolute heartbreaking and then they come like towards the end they come to this city and like this girl's like oh i'm gonna get adopters and it's like oh yes you're a player made for my dog and that dog's better than you and it needs its urges and then it's just like Aah. so yeah um aside from a few questionable choices this is an absolute fantastic series and um, I really enjoyed volume one and I really do encourage people to pick it up and try it out I can't really discuss it too much because there's that much it's that dark it, but it's so worth reading and um, please check it out and um, at the moment running and showing jump um, they've actually got a new a new series called Chainsaw Man which is by the same author as this and um, that's shaping up to be great as well because yes I'm, I haven't forgotten about Chainsaw Man I will be picking that up and um, doing a discussion once there's a few more chapters but yes Fire Punch I don't know how it hasn't got an anime but I can understand that there's probably a lot of content that they can't do anything with but yes definitely please do uh, check it out if you like your dark stuff that's it from me thank you for coming and thanks again for staying goodbye Oh no, the fire punch has killed Ace. What a pity. Did you enjoy that? Well, we've got some other stuff on the site if you want to have a little bit of look. Nendoroids, gaming, One Piece merchandise, it's all kind of there. So if you click around here, you'll be able to subscribe or at least have a look on the channel. Also, there's some other things just around here. Thanks for coming and thanks again. Goodbye.